everybody, welcome to another episode of 60 Formula. Hope you're doing well today. The past few days have been absolutely nutso. My computer crashed, I lost all this footage. Basically, my editing program that I use to build all these episodes that I show you guys, it failed. Like it basically wouldn't even function. Every single time I tried to export a video or try to send one to YouTube, my program was like, no way broski. I'm not gonna function right. So I was freaking out just a little bit. I was like, oh dude, how am I gonna get the episodes of the Pupperonis out to the peeps on YouTube? So it took me a couple of days to actually figure out the problem and what was going on. And that last episode you guys got, the one where they went to the vet, oh my goodness. In the process of trying to fix all that stuff, half of that episode got deleted. So that episode ended up being like this insane Frankenstein episode. Oh, uh, the stress levels were off of the chart. I was like, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So it's kind of just been crazy over here at the 60 Formula house. I've been trying to figure out how to get everything back on track. At one point I was like, bro, do I need, do I need to buy a new computer? Luckily I didn't have to. Thank the good golly goodness. Now that we're good, it's time to train Huskies. You heard me right, baby. Train. Huskies, we're gonna be training Huskies how to do tricks and so much more this week, and I cannot wait to get started with you guys. So if you have a Siberian Huskaronin pizza at home and you've been waiting for episodes on how to train them, how to do all the tricks in the book, well, guess what? This is going to be the week for you. And it all starts here with this episode. You don't have to pay a trainer a thousand bajillion dollars just to get your doggo to do something. All you gotta do is come on over to Six to Formula and we're gonna show you exactly how to train your Husky. And by the way, these methods work for any dog breed. So if you don't have a Husky at home, if you just enjoy watching the episodes, but you have a different type of dog and you still wanna train your pup to do tricks, you better stay tuned because this is gonna teach you how to do it. So like I said, if you ever wanna teach your dog how to stand, good girl. If you wanna teach your Siberian Husky how to speak, if you wanna teach him how to spin, good girl, one more spin. One more spin. Good girls. Or maybe you just want to teach your husky to sit and then make them stay as you slowly walk away into the kitchen and get your favorite Eggo waffles. Are they still there? Oh, they're still staying. Then like I said 50 Brazilian times, this is gonna be the episode for you. So come with us, will you, on another episode of 60 Formula, where we learn an introduction on how to teach our Siberian Huskies all of the basic tricks. Are you ready? <laughs> all right, let's do it. <laughs> Looky real, he's like, uh, another episode about training Huskies. Good lordy. I know, it's not gonna include kitty cats, but you know what, at least you can stand by and watch, you know? You take a little nap, and then while I train the Huskies, you could just, ch yeah, you could be my, my side man. You know what I'm saying? You like that idea? Okay, well, it's done. You're hired, bruh. Can I get a little, a little head nudge? Give Bowie. Okie dokie, Smokey Maloki. So you got yourself a Siberian Husky or you're trying to train your dog how to do some tricks. If you're looking to get right into the thick of things, we got videos coming out for you in the next couple of days that are gonna teach you how to get right into how to do all of these tricks immediately. But if you're brand new at dog training, if you got a little Husky puppy or you've never taught your dog anything at all, this is the place to start. And it's important that you start here. We need to create building blocks on how we train our dog. By training our dog in baby steps, with building blocks, following a schedule and a routine, doing this over and over again after week after week, your dog is going to learn how to do things super quick, so it's essential that they know the very basics of what to do whenever they're learning how to be trained. Now, let me start out by saying this. There are a ton of dog trainers out there and a lot of them have their own methods, but don't let people fool you into thinking that you are wrong in the way that you train your dog. There's a lot of people out there that want a lot of money. They're like, you need me to train your dog for $7 million. It's the only way your dog will be trained. Don't believe this hypeness. All you gotta do is get your dog's attention, have a great relationship with them, spend a little bit of time, and it will probably take you no more than two months to train your dog how to do every single trick 
in the book. But you gotta make sure that you're teaching them the things that they need to know before you start getting into everything. I know so many people who get a dog and they go, okay, immediately I want to teach them how to sit. So the first thing you're gonna learn is sit when their dog doesn't even know how to look at them and pay attention and barely even knows their own name. So let's get into the essentials right now. Let's start talking about the things you need to know whenever you're getting into training your dog. So the number one tool that you are gonna need whenever you are training your Siberian Huskies or any dog is going to be treats. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, look, treats. Yeah, that's what's up, dude. Now, a lot of trainers say all you need is a toy or positive reinforcement, like petting them on the head or saying, good boy or good girl, which is very true. You can use those things, but nothing works better than Food. So if you go to the store, you grab some dog treats, that should be some good currency for the rewards that you'll be given your Huscarona pizza when they're doing all the stuff that you want them to learn. So when you come home with your brand new dog or your brand new Husky, it's likely they don't know their name. And in fact, they're probably a Husky puppy, so they're probably running around the ground like a million miles per hour, going in circles, sniffing under everything, getting in all the trouble that they could ever get into. <laughs> Look at her, she's like, yeah, Huskies love trouble. So the first thing you're gonna wanna focus on is getting your Husky's attention. When you teach your dog to focus on you, it teaches them how to break the distraction or whatever they're doing at the time, leave that distraction entirely and focus on on you. Now this is something that dogs struggle with all the time and if you don't train it early it's almost impossible to get them to follow any command or do any trick and this will be apparent tenfold whenever you go outside and try and train them to do things out there. So what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna teach you guys exactly how to teach your Siberian Husky or your pup at home how to learn their name and learn how to focus on you. Now this may not seem like much and I know it's not teaching your dog how to do a backflip yet, but if you know how to get your dog's attention, if they know how to focus on you, you're gonna be able to teach them how to do anything going forward. <laughs> Look at her, she's like, dude, I know all the tricky tricks. Britney Spears is like, I'm gonna take a nap, dude. It's, it's time for me to take a nap. I'm like, I'm, I'm tired, bro. Okay, so what you wanna do is get your Husky in a room with you. They may be running around, they may not be sitting down like this. Either way, you're gonna get their attention by showing them a high value treat. Yeah, that's right, I got it in my hand right now. Now, right now, I'm actually using Life Cereal. They're little pieces of, you know, whole wheat cereal, which is completely fine for a doggo, but we do recommend getting dog treats like dog jerky or something that's really healthy for your dog. But since both of my Huscaroni pizzas are used to literally every single dog treat on the market, it takes a little bit something special for us, so we're using Life Cereal. Now, in my opinion, in my experience, one of the best forms of currency is turkey. Oh yeah, baby, that good old sliced deli turkey you get from Publix or your local market. Your doggo will almost certainly always do whatever you want them to for a piece of turkey. So if you're not getting your dog's attention by using dog cookies or dog biscuits, go ahead and go get some turkey from the market. It's going to be your best friend. The first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take the treat. They're gonna see it. They're gonna be really enticed and like, oh, thick left, thick right. Big left, big right. Your dog is going to be very interested in it, okay? You're gonna put it way over here, but you're gonna ask them to look at you. So choose a word that you want. You can say focus or look at me, but you're gonna keep the treat far away from your face. Do me a favor, focus. Right here, eyes right here, good girl. So you guys saw that as soon as Gila gave me her eyes, as soon as she looked at me instead of the treat, she got the reward. And this is how we teach our pup to focus. Now, one time isn't gonna do it. You're gonna have to practice this several times for several weeks. So look, we're gonna put the treat out here again. Focus. Good girl, there it was. So we'll do the same thing with Britney Spears. We'll put the uh, cereal out here. Focus, good boy, there it was. He looked right over at me just for a second. It doesn't have to be long. They don't have to stare at you. They don't have to look at you for forever. Just let them know the basic gist of it. As long as you give me your eyes and you focus on me, you're, you're understanding. So let's try it again. Here we got the tree. Yeah, you see it? Put it over here. Focus. Good boy, that was good, I like that. That was a good distance. Thank you for turning your head like that. So you saw right there, I just wait until they give me their eyes. Once they do, they get that treat, baby. That big reward. So I'm gonna show you guys just one more time with Hila. We got the treat right here. We're gonna put it way over here. Focus. Good girl. 
looked right at me. So now that you know to practice this, now that you guys know, hey, this is exactly how I get my Husky's attention, they're gonna start doing it automatically. Good girl, yeah, you got it, you got it. You saw that, I didn't even tell her to look at me, I didn't tell her to focus, I didn't even try to get her attention, I just put the treat right out here. That's what's up, lady. That's how you do it. Now, once you become a pro at this, this is when you can start teaching your Husky exactly what their name is. When you take the treat, you show it to them, and you put it out here, instead of saying focus, start switching the word focus with whatever your Husky's name is. And as soon as they give you those eyes, as soon as they look up at you, that is when you give them the treat. Like I said, it does not need to be for long. As long as they glance over at you, as long as they give you those eyes, be sure to give them that reward. Always practice this. Practice this over and over and over and over. And eventually, you're gonna get your dog's attention every single time, and they're gonna know what their name is. This is a simple practice, one that professionals use in the industry today. And you can use this to get your Husky's attention and teach them what their name is. This is gonna make for a better recall if you decide to teach your Husky to be off leash, and it's gonna help you teach them more commands, and they'll be more responsive when complying to those demands. So remember, practice this all the time. Having your dog focus on you is vital in training them new tricks. That's a good boy, can I get a paw? Yeah, good job, sir, good job. He's like, yeah, give me back my foot, dude. <laughs> give it back. So that's how you train your Siberian Husky to focus on you and learn what their name is. It does take a lot of practice. You're gonna be working on it for a couple of weeks, but don't worry, they're going to get it ASAP. And sooner than later, you're gonna be going, Gila, come, sit, focus. Paw, other paw, speak. <laughs> Hila, stand. Good girl. Hila, stand. Stay. Good girl. Spin. That's my princess. Good job. You the best, dude. High five. Thank you. If you guys had fun today, don't forget to smash that like button and hit subscribe so you don't miss any more Huskaroni Pizza episodes and you stay up to date on all the goodness. If you haven't checked out our Reddit yet, be sure to go down in the description and check it out and you can also get merch with Gila's face and Britney Spears face if you like t-shirts and stuff. So go check that out as well. And until next time, we'll see you with another episode of Guess What? <laughs> yep, whatever we make. Peace! Ba da ba da ba 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 da 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 ba da